Have you ever gazed at the night sky and wondered about the mysterious red star named Betelgeuse? Betelgeuse, pronounced as Betelgeuse, is a fascinating celestial body that captivates stargazers and astronomers alike. It's located in the constellation of Orion, also known as the Hunter. If you've ever seen three stars in a row, that's Orion's belt. Look above that, and you'll spot Betelgeuse, a ruddy star that forms the Hunter's left shoulder. Now, Betelgeuse isn't just any ordinary star, it's classified as a red supergiant, one of the largest and most luminous stars in the night sky. Picture this, if you were to replace the Sun with Betelgeuse, it would extend beyond the orbit of Jupiter. That's how massive it is. But size isn't the only thing that sets Betelgeuse apart. It's also a variable star, meaning its brightness changes over time. Sometimes it's the brightest star in Orion, other times, it's outshone by Rigel, the blue supergiant that marks Orion's foot. But Betelgeuse's most captivating feature is its color. Unlike most stars that twinkle in white or blue, Betelgeuse glows with a deep, rich red. This is because it's cooler than many other stars. Just like a metal that glows red when it's heated and turns white or blue when it gets hotter, stars follow the same principle. The cooler they are, the redder they glow. Yet, for all its visible grandeur, Betelgeuse is a star shrouded in dark enigmas. Its unpredictable behavior, its unusual size, and its vibrant color all contribute to its mystery. These secrets have sparked countless debates and fueled numerous research studies among the scientific community. And as we journey through the cosmos, these mysteries only seem to deepen, making Betelgeuse a cosmic conundrum that continues to baffle and bewitch us. But this seemingly ordinary star is shrouded in dark mysteries that will unravel as we delve deeper. The story of Betelgeuse begins with its discovery in the early 17th century. Set your sights back to a time when the universe was still a grand mystery waiting to be unraveled. It was during this period that the unique red star, Betelgeuse, was first observed and recorded by the keen eyes of early astronomers. Among these pioneers of the cosmos was Sir John Herschel, a British polymath and a titan in the field of astronomy. Herschel's contributions to science were numerous, but it was his study of Betelgeuse that stands out in our tale. With his advanced telescopic technology for that era, Herschel was able to observe and document the distinct red hue of Betelgeuse, a characteristic that was markedly different from other stars in the night sky. Betelgeuse's unique red color is due to its classification as a red supergiant star. You see, stars emit light in different colors depending on their surface temperature. Cooler stars like Betelgeuse emit light at the red end of the spectrum, hence their red appearance. This color difference was a tantalizing clue to the underlying properties of Betelgeuse, and it spurred astronomers to delve deeper into its mysteries. It's essential to understand that during the 17th century, the study of stars and their properties was still in its infancy. The unique qualities of Betelgeuse, such as its red color, served as a beacon in the night sky, guiding the way for further astronomical exploration and discovery. Its noteworthy characteristics made it a subject of interest among the scientific community, and it has remained so for centuries. In the grand scheme of things, Betelgeuse is a relatively young star, yet its size and brightness have earned it a prominent place in the constellation of Orion and in the annals of astronomical history. The early discovery of Betelgeuse set the stage for centuries of investigation into this red giant and its many mysteries. Little did they know, this red giant held secrets that would perplex scientists for centuries. Betelgeuse is no ordinary star, its characteristics are as enigmatic as they are fascinating. This cosmic behemoth, residing in the constellation of Orion, has a radius that's about 900 times that of our Sun. If it were to replace our Sun, its surface would extend beyond the orbit of Mars. Just imagine that. But it's not just its colossal size that makes Betelgeuse a subject of intrigue. It's also one of the most luminous stars in the night sky. Its brightness doesn't remain constant, however. Betelgeuse is a variable star, meaning its light varies over time. Sometimes it's the 10th brightest star in the sky, and at other times, it barely makes it to the top 20. This variability is due to the pulsations of the star itself. Betelgeuse expands and contracts over a period of approximately 420 days, changing its brightness as it goes through this cycle. This pulsation, combined with the star's massive size, has a significant effect on its outer layers, causing them to be expelled into space. It's a bit like a celestial heartbeat pumping stardust into the cosmos. Now, you might think that a star as big and bright as Betelgeuse would be easy to study, but it's not that simple. 
Betelgeuse is a red supergiant, which means it's nearing the end of its life. And because of its variability, it's hard to predict exactly what it's going to do next. It's like trying to forecast the weather on a planet hundreds of light years away. Scientists are intrigued by this stellar enigma. Betelgeuse's unusual properties have led them to ask questions about its past and future. Is it about to go supernova, or will it slowly fade away? These are questions that continue to puzzle astronomers, making Betelgeuse one of the most fascinating objects in our night sky. These puzzling properties have led to some intriguing theories about the star's fate. But what truly sets Betelgeuse apart is its dark side, a side that has puzzled astronomers for years. This enormous red supergiant, one of the brightest stars in our night sky, has been known to mysteriously dim from time to time. These darkening events, or fading episodes, are a significant part of the Betelgeuse enigma. One theory suggests that these events might be due to vast clouds of dust obscuring the star's light. This dust, it's believed, could be expelled from Betelgeuse itself. Imagine a star so volatile it belches out clouds of cosmic dust large enough to dim its own light. It's an intriguing idea, but the dust theory isn't the only one on the table. Another explanation points to stellar pulsations. Betelgeuse is a variable star, meaning its brightness fluctuates over time. These fluctuations could be the result of pulsations or changes in the star's size and temperature. Think of Betelgeuse as a celestial heartbeat, rhythmically contracting and expanding its pulsations causing it to dim and brighten in a cosmic dance. Then there's the most dramatic theory of all, the impending supernova. Some scientists speculate that these darkening events could be signs that Betelgeuse is nearing the end of its life and could explode in a supernova. This would be a sight to behold as for a few weeks Betelgeuse would outshine even the moon in our night sky. But before you get too excited, this event, if it happens at all, could be thousands or even millions of years in the future. These theories, while fascinating, are just that. Theories. The true cause of Betelgeuse's darkening events remains unknown. What we do know is that studying these events gives us a unique opportunity to learn more about the life cycle of stars and the mysteries of our universe. The dark side of Betelgeuse is a riddle that scientists are working tirelessly to solve. And who knows? The solution to this cosmic mystery might just rewrite our understanding of the stars. One theory that has captivated the scientific community is that Betelgeuse is on the verge of going supernova. Now let's delve deeper into this fascinating theory. What exactly does it mean for a star to go supernova? In simple terms, a supernova is a massive explosion that occurs at the end of a star's life cycle. It's like the final, grand fireworks display of a star, marking the end of its stellar journey. But don't let the term explosion mislead you into thinking it's a quick, short-lived event. A supernova is an event of cosmic proportions, releasing energy equivalent to the total energy our sun will emit over its entire lifespan. So, what would it mean if Betelgeuse were to explode in a supernova? Well, it would certainly be a sight to behold. Despite being about 640 light years away, Betelgeuse's supernova would be so bright that it would be visible from Earth even in broad daylight outshining every celestial body in the sky except our sun. But worry not, despite its impressive display, it poses no danger to Earth due to its vast distance from us. But is there any evidence that supports the theory of Betelgeuse going supernova? Indeed, there is. In late 2019, astronomers noticed that Betelgeuse started to dim dramatically, losing about two-thirds of its brightness in just a few months. This sudden dimming led many to speculate that Betelgeuse was nearing the end of its life and was about to go supernova. However, not all astronomers are convinced by this theory. Some suggest that the dimming could be due to a cloud of dust obscuring the star's light or a cycle of brightness and dimness that Betelgeuse goes through every few years. In 2020, Betelgeuse returned to its regular brightness, leading many to believe that the supernova theory might have been premature. But the debate continues. The truth is, we don't know for certain what's happening with Betelgeuse. It's a star that keeps scientists guessing, a cosmic enigma that refuses to reveal its secrets easily. And that's what makes it so intriguing. It's important to remember that the universe operates on a timescale far beyond human comprehension. For all we know, Betelgeuse might have already exploded hundreds of years ago, and the light from the supernova is still on its way to us or it might not go supernova for another 100,000 years. Whether or not Betelgeuse will go supernova is a question that only time can answer. But one thing's for sure, the mystery of Betelgeuse continues to captivate us, reminding us of the vast, unexplored cosmos that lies beyond our reach, waiting to reveal its secrets. 
So what does the future hold for this mysterious red giant? As we gaze into the cosmic crystal ball, the future of Betelgeuse is as enigmatic as its past. There are a few possible scenarios that astronomers have speculated could play out. One of the most anticipated events is Betelgeuse going supernova. In stellar terms, this is the grand finale, an explosion of such magnitude that for a brief period, the star outshines an entire galaxy. Given its size and age, Betelgeuse is nearing the end of its life cycle, and a supernova event could occur within the next hundred thousand years, a mere blink of an eye in cosmic terms. When it does, it will shine as bright as a full moon and be visible even during the day. But what happens after the fireworks? The remaining core of Betelgeuse will most likely collapse into a neutron star, an incredibly dense object about the size of a city, but with a mass greater than the sun. If the core is massive enough, it could even transform into a black hole, a region of space where gravity is so strong that not even light can escape. The future of Betelgeuse is not just a curiosity for astronomers. It's a chance to witness a rare cosmic event that could provide valuable insights into the life cycles of stars. It could help us refine our understanding of supernova, neutron stars, and black holes. More than that, it's a reminder of the transient nature of celestial bodies and the ever-evolving universe. As we continue to observe and speculate, Betelgeuse remains an intriguing celestial mystery. Its unpredictable behavior and imminent fate captivate us, reminding us of the vast dynamic cosmos that exists beyond our world. It's a celestial spectacle that underscores the beauty and mystery of the universe. In the grand cosmic theater, Betelgeuse is a star that surely knows how to keep the audience guessing. As we journey through the cosmos, Betelgeuse serves as a reminder of the universe's infinite complexity. Betelgeuse, this enigmatic star, has intrigued us from the moment of its discovery. Its sheer size, dwarfing our own sun and its pulsating nature, have kept scientists on their toes. Its fiery red hue, a sign of its advanced age and imminent demise, adds to its allure. This massive celestial body continues to pose more questions than answers, its mysteries unraveling slowly as our technology and understanding advance. The puzzling properties of Betelgeuse have been a topic of heated discussion. Its varying brightness, the so-called darkening events, have led to many theories. Some suggest it's the result of gigantic star spots, others propose it's due to dust clouds obscuring our view. The truth remains elusive, a testament to the infinite complexity of the universe. One of the most intriguing aspects we delved into is the supernova theory. When Betelgeuse explodes, it will create a spectacular sight, outshining the moon and becoming visible even during the day. However, this cataclysmic event could occur any time from now to a million years into the future. The unpredictability of the event only adds to the star's mystique. The future of Betelgeuse is as uncertain as its past is intriguing. Will it meet its end in a fiery supernova? Or will it gradually fade away, and, when it does, what will fill the void it leaves behind? These questions keep astronomers awake at night, their telescopes trained on this red giant, hoping to catch a glimpse of its final act. In conclusion, Betelgeuse, with its dark side and enigmatic nature, serves as a stark reminder of our place in the cosmos. It's a symbol of the eternal struggle between creation and destruction, a testament to the beauty and terror of the universe. So next time you gaze at the night sky, spare a thought for Betelgeuse, the red giant with a dark side.